Yeah. Right off the bat. What is up, everybody, and welcome to this week's taste test challenge. This week I've got a couple more of the flavored pretzels that I got here. This is uh, the second batch that I'm doing out of this recent order that I did. This one here is sour cream and onion flavored. And this one here is garlic parmesan flavored. Now, I did another garlic one. Uh, it was the first one I did. I don't remember the exact flavor, but I know it was different than this. I did look that up a little bit ago before I decided to get this stuff. <clears throat> but these are two more flavors. I got two more left that you'll be seeing in another uh, few weeks or so. But I'm going to try these, see how these are. So far, they have all been really, really good. So this first one here, sour cream and onion flavored pretzels see what we get okay I can kind of smell the sour cream in there a little bit hint of onion smells like kind of smells like French onion soup yeah it kind of smells like French onion soup a little bit yep all right so let's see what we get here it looks like there's a lot of flavoring on there it looks like there's a lot of powder on these so let's see Yeah. Right off the bat, get the sour cream flavoring. Right off the bat. Tastes like, <clears throat> take a potato chip, <clears throat> dip it in some French dip, sour cream and onion dressing. That's good. That's exactly what that tastes like. Very good, strong flavor in there, too. Essentially, it's basically if you take a pretzel and dip it into that French dip, sour cream and onion dip, it's exactly what that tastes like. <clears throat> exactly what that tastes like. Good, strong flavoring in there. And you get the hint of the pretzel in there afterwards also. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's good. That is good. <clears throat> Alright, that one's going to be up there a little bit, guys. That's going to be up there a little bit. That flavoring in there is fantastic. It's it's perfectly blended. As soon as you put it in your mouth, you get that, you get the hit of the sour cream and onion flavor. That's really good. I'm going to give that one, I'm going to give that one like an 8.7. 8.7. That's that flavoring in there is really good, really fantastic. And that might even be a little bit low. I probably, probably could have gone higher, but I already gave the score. But yeah, wow, that's really good. That's really good. Sour cream and onion. All right, <clears throat> this one, garlic, Parmesan. I love garlic. I love Parmesan. Let's see what this one is. It looks like there's a lot of flavor on here, too, a lot of powder on them. Okay, hint of the garlic, and a little bit hint of Parmesan. I can kind of smell both. I can kind of smell both. Not very strong. Not very strong, but they are there. They are there. All right, let's see what these taste like. <laughs> wow. Wow, are those good. Good, strong garlic flavor. Not a whole lot of Parmesan, but it's there. It's like it's just accenting the garlic. There's more garlic flavor in there than anything else. The Parmesan is there slightly at the end. Kind of just mixes in a little bit at the end with it.
Mm-hmm. Wow, those are good. All of these, all of these that I've tasted so far have been good. They're from pretzels.com. I'll put it right down here. Pretzels.com. And they have a bunch of different flavors. They got kits that you can order. Um, sample kits. They all come this size though. You can't get like no big bags or anything like that. They all come in these containers in this size. So you can order singly, you can order a kit, you can order a package. Wow, that was good too. I'm going to give that one. That's going to be not as good as this one. I like the flavoring in this one a lot more, but the flavoring here is good. So I'm going to give that I'm going to give that one probably like an 8.2. It's still going to be up in the 8s. 8.2. Wow. These things, all of these guys, I've tried what? Five, six, seven, eight of these now already. And every single one of them, every single one of them has been very, very good. The one in the first one, I think it was the Chipotle flavored one. Didn't really care for that one. I didn't like the flavoring of it. But as far as if you would like that flavoring, it was good. Good, strong flavor. These all have very good, strong flavoring on them. And then they're not that expensive either. They're not that expensive. You can, you know, one of these will fill up a bowl for a party, you know, very easily. Very easily. <clears throat> All right, guys. Well, that was this week's taste test challenge. Another of these flavored pretzels, which so far, by my opinion, have been, all of them have been fantastic. I got two more left to do, which you'll probably be see coming up in uh, a couple weeks or so. <sighs> yeah. But anyway, guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. Leave me a comment down below what you thought of it. If you tried these, if you haven't. I know I keep saying that in every video, but you know I'm just curious if, if you've tried them um, and what your thoughts were on them. Anyway, guys, that's it. Come back next Tuesday for another taste test challenge. And I will see you guys then. Thanks, guys.